Assalamu alaikum hello everyone this is Salwa of Salwa's Cape Malay Cooking. Today I'm sharing with you how I make my colored buns recipe. So for this recipe you'll need about three cups of flour. It can be all-purpose cake flour or plain flour. One teaspoon salt, two teaspoons sugar and one teaspoon instant yeast. Mix it all together. Make a little well in the center. Add two teaspoons of Oil can be olive or plain oil, vegetable oil. Food coloring of your choice. I use Colormel or Walton. It should be an oil-based uh, food coloring. And then I've added about three cups of lukewarm water. You may need more water, but I always start with three quarter cups. Half to three quarter cups of water. And then you'll just uh, mix it together until it forms a dough. And then you can put it on your work surface and knead it further for about 10 minutes until it's smooth and the dough feels soft. It should look like that. And um, if you use a good quality food coloring, it won't leave an after effect in the rolls or in your mouth afterwards. It just take like, tastes like normal rolls. And there I'm making orange ones. The same recipe, 3 cups flour, 1 teaspoon salt, 2 teaspoons sugar, your yeast, your food colouring and then your lukewarm water. Mix it all together and again knead until it's smooth and soft. Cover with cling foam, a plastic wrap and then leave it aside until it's well risen, about an hour. And it should look like that when it's risen, soft and pillowy. Then uh, divide into 10 equal sizes. For this recipe, 3 cups of flour, you'll get about 10 rolls. So I've divided into 10 equal pieces. And then you just smooth it out on your work surface or between your hands. Hold your hand into like a cup, like a, like I've shown you there. Hollow inside and then roll it until it's smooth. And uh, onto greaseproof paper. Or you can put it directly in your baking tin. But I like to use greaseproof paper to prevent, uh, to save you from washing up. Onto the yellow ones, the same process, divide into 10 pieces. And you can easily equal our, I mean, you can easily double the recipe if you need more. And this is a perfect way to serve your, your burgers for your next party. It's, it's very, it's a big hit with the kids. At kids parties you can use any color that you prefer and then um, after you've made it into balls let it rise for about 20 minutes again in the pan and I've uh, washed it with a bit of um, milk and put some added some sesame seeds so the reason I use milk is not to for the color to turn to uh, brown when it bakes. You just want a nice subtle color like that. So the I've baked it at 180 degrees Celsius for about 10-12 minutes and you have your perfect colored bun. And I've um, made various other colors as well as you can see and just ensure you use a good quality food coloring like caramel, Walton or any uh, oil based food coloring and make sure to follow me on YouTube at Cape Malay Cooking for further recipes or Facebook as well. Thank you and hope to see you soon.